is problematic. Although they are, the, they are the silent workers, the silent farmers, they are the people, they would feed because they are the people who are responsible for the family in the first place. Most of the time, male farmers would produce for the market. But there is the, the woman who would produce to feed the family. And so a lot of the time, they, they, are not, they are not consulted in many things. I mean, you are going to have a meeting in the community about farming. It's always about the male farmers. Because first of all, they are the head of the family. Secondly, they are people who own the land, because the women may not own the land. And therefore, they are the people who take decisions about these things. You know. So that's the situation we have. But these are the issues we are working against. We're trying to see how do we open up this whole system. And, and, and this, this, the, the, the special way we are doing it, especially at SICOT, because we believe that if we're going to have any change, we might do it from the context of the people, from the context of the indigenous way of thinking, and work through that. It's possible to make a change. If we do it from our side, it's very difficult. So we've developed different methodologies by which we work with communities to get them to recognize the voice and the value of women as farmers.